Welcome back to the program, and also welcome back to the program. A very familiar face, you're almost a regular on hey. this show. <laughs> Just thinking about a carousel makes me want to uh, get a little nauseous. Go, go in circles? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Anything that moves around this way or up and down. Yeah. You're like, you're no, out of there. I'm good. Uh, Maestro Joseph Junta joining us in studio from the one You just go back and forth, uh, right? You I stand. Yeah, yeah, that kind of gets yeah. people going, That's too, exactly. though. You hypnotize but, them like But I that. can't see myself doing this. Ah, <laughs> okay. okay. Well, you close your eyes when yeah. you're doing it? No or? kidding. Anyway, but you have something coming up uh, that is really going to get a lot of people's attention. We do. This Sunday at 730, Waterworks Park. It's the second concert of our new series. Uh, the first one had about 5,000 people 5, there. 5,000? Wow. It was, it was over 90 degrees when we started the concert at 730 at night. I mean, that was really that quite awesome. remarkable. Uh, the last one, and uh, it exceeded all of our expectations. Jackie was there. I was so. going to say, I have to say congratulations. It was everything you could hope for in that scenario. If you're trying to take what you do at Yankee Doodle Pops and move it to a new location, beautiful space, incredible music, Thank you. amazing soloists. Thank you. Uh, I think it's, it, it, it did everything you were hoping yeah, for. Yeah, we were, we were very excited. And, you know, a, a big thank you goes to our staff because they're sort of the troubleshooters. They're the ones that sort of anticipate what could go wrong and then try to not let it go wrong. Mm -hmm. So, But you really had no idea how many people were going to come to this we, first one, did we you? We did not. And, and the first one was really smashing and successful. And, uh, you know, we didn't have any traffic issues or, uh, uh, you know, all kinds of things that could happen outside. So it was a, a good first step for us, and we're looking forward to even improving this next and how's the sound uh, at that facility? Sound is fabulous. Perfect. Uh, we have it's our perfect. we have our own sound guy that comes in. They bring we bring our own sound system. Uh, it's even better than Yankee Doodle Pops, we think, for, really? for a variety of reasons. It's a little bit more contained, so it's really exciting. And this particular program, we think, is even uh, uh, getting a little bit more buzz than the first one. It's an all John Williams spectacular. This and is stuff so everybody you, will recognize. You obviously had a very well-known soloist that was a huge appeal, but even if you're not a, you know what Hamilton is, maybe you're not a huge Hamilton fan or know what the music is, where this, who doesn't know a song that this man well, has written? Exactly. It's hard to believe he's he's written movies for over six decades his wow. first one was 1958 he's written over music for over a hundred movies he has uh, 24 uh, Grammy Awards 51 Academy Award nominations and that's only second to Walt Disney so wow. it's hard to believe that this guy really has been working in in this business for so long his big break of course came with Jaws in 1975 and then the rest is history yeah so. here's here's what the symphony is gonna sound like Dun, dun, dun. They're going to play that two notes dun, dun, the dun, entire time. Those, those are the two biggest money notes in Hollywood. Right? You think so? Joke. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. And so here's some visuals of the last one out there, just showing you. I, I know it's probably a little more steamy for you up on stage. I thought it was absolutely <laughs> perfect, uh, where people were bringing their blankets. They were bringing their lawn chairs. Uh, if you didn't have a picnic that you brought yourself, there were it didn't matter. There were food trucks, beverages, food, everything on hand so people could really just claim their space. And there was plenty of it. Uh, you saw people coming in hours before the concert. You saw people showing up minutes before. And there was really uh, people were, could just relax, enjoy, and uh, just have a great time. Now, uh, as we see some various crowd shots here uh, and also the maestro being on stage, there was an opportunity uh, to ride your bike. That's what uh, we did to go down there. Super easy to get in. They grabbed your bike, they took care of it, and then had it ready for you to go at the end of the evening. So I highly encourage you. Uh, it's supposed to be a gorgeous night on Sunday to uh, ride your bike down. Great trail system there, but just an incredible crowd. I can only imagine what it looked like uh, from the stage. This is the first time I'm seeing these photographs. Oh, okay. Oh, really? Well, here you go. <laughs> so you look just mesmerized <laughs> by these. Well, uh, uh, so this is the general admission yeah. area. We want to remind everybody there is a VIP area that's available as well, a little bit closer, and you have a table and chairs to sit at if you're wanting to be a little more comfortable uh, that way. But that also sold out last time, so we encourage you what to get stage. those tickets uh, as early as possible. Uh, and then after you came out pretty formal, you, you're, you're relaxed a little bit. I'm sure you enjoyed that. I like that, that look. I'm sure you enjoyed that costume you. change with as hot as it was uh, that evening. But uh, you start in the daylight, you go into the evening, and it is just a glorious, glorious time. And this weekend, again, coming up, this next performance, uh, we kind of hinted at who this was, but John Williams music. Yeah, all yeah, John Williams. Talking about. Star all John Williams yep. all the time. Yep, Star Wars, Harry Potter, Jurassic Park, uh, Raiders, uh, The Cowboys, which is not an unknown film, an old John Wayne uh, Western from the 1960s. Oh, that is uh, cool. So a little bit of 
familiar music, a lot of familiar music, and a little bit of unfamiliar music. We're also doing a beautiful setting of Lincoln. Uh, you know, John Williams wrote some pretty serious music too, but okay. this is the movie Lincoln that was in the, from about 20 years ago. It's a gorgeous film, by the way, and uh, the music is stunning and beautiful. And we've got a narrator, of course, in, in Charlie Reese. Charlie's yeah. going to be uh, uh, portraying some characters along the way. So it's going to be a great night. 7.30, Waterworks Park. Information is on our website, of course, dmsymphony.org. All free, but as Jackie said, there are VIP tables. And uh, if you want information about that, once again, on our website. Okay, now, before no, you go, no, yeah, before uh -oh. you go, there's something, uh, someone might be vying for your job. Yeah, I understand. We saw this popping what up on is social media. What's going on? That's right. A mini, a mini maestro? That's right. Mini maestro. Um, <laughs> not that I'm so uh, tall in stature here, but we are going to find somebody that's about that tall between <laughs> probably the ages of 8 and 12. We okay. Think, or 8 and 14. All right, what's the deal here? And we're having auditions in front of the crowd for I love it. Uh, uh, any kid that applies through our website. And we hope to have, you know, a dozen or so kids. And we're going to judge them. The audience is going to judge them. And then they're going to conduct the opening of Super. Superman. No way. I love it. So you do need to be under 18, otherwise there's a bunch of us that probably yeah, jump be on board yeah. to yeah, exactly. see, we'll see if we can take your job. Look at this. <laughs> I, I know that'd picture. be impossible because <laughs> yeah. uh, you would are you are impossible to replace. But if you're under 18, you can get more details online or otherwise they're saying email uh, info at DMS, uh, excuse me, dmsymphony.org. Otherwise you can tag a video of your little one uh, doing their best conducting <laughs> skills on social media. They're going to choose the top Top five to audition uh, this Sunday. <laughs> you know, I love I love this thing mainly because. Um you know, we're the ones as adults that we tell children, don't do this and don't do that. Mm -hmm. But when they're at a certain age, they have this, sort of this unbridled energy. And this is a chance for them to really shine. So we're looking I forward to it. it. We're going to have a lot of fun with it. This I love awesome. it. And that's going to be yeah. right at 730. So make sure you get there on time so you can see uh, this wonderful opportunity. It, exactly. And then leading right into an all John Williams evening of incredible music. Yeah, this is going to be a lot of fun. You are going to exceed what you had last time. I hope so. For this one. I hope, no and the, and the weather's supposed to be Beautiful, it's supposed so. to be absolutely perfect. Yeah. So bring your blanket, bring your lawn chair. If you don't want to worry about any of that, just get a VIP pass and you are good to go. Yeah, I like the VIP I idea. Right Me too. That. Perfect. Yeah. Joseph Junta, thank you so much, Maestro, for oh. coming in as always. Great always to a pleasure. See you. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you so much. All right.